Hello there! I am Atelier Sam and we have dropped from 16 down to 15 with 39 stars, unfortunately. Here's my log, it's not the greatest. And here's why. Bases have beefed up drastically with additional building damage and building health. And my warriors aren't enough to take those down. So I transition not to tanks, but here's the thing now. Yeah, tanks are here. I maxed them out. Here's the thing. I have not got under gunboat energy. So, what am I gonna do next? I thought I was gonna unlock it after 4 yard, but I was one key shy. So we are going to do that today. We're probably gonna drop even further down, but hopefully once we get jump out energy, here's my base by the way, it's maybe average, but I don't know how well it defends against high level players. But let's try to get back into goal. Alright, and the tanks at the moment with not without GBE, they're kinda useless, so I still have to stick with warriors until I get that extra key. Okay, four yard, great, okay. Can we do this one? Maybe we can. Or maybe not, we'll see. The shock mines are in fact not on the base, so that's good. So we're gonna try this. Shock, shock. And shock. Destroy that shock mine. Shock this stuff. And looks like things are going well over here. Except this flamethrower. Let's lead you all the way over here. Man. These are going good, but these defenses just won't stop. No. Well, that's too bad. Against Mbap. Whatever that is, he has tanks, of course. Yep, warriors aren't just cutting it right now, which is bad news for me. If we can have a transition from tanks to. No, from warriors to tanks. And this transition has been really rough. Really, really rough. So if you're not careful, this base will take you around 2 minutes and 20 seconds. Around that time, if you're not careful. But if you are careful and do this base properly, you'll get around like 235, I think. Just shock it. Yeah, whatever. You win anyway, it doesn't even matter. Whatever. Minus eight. One. Okay. Okay. Another four year with a dome cannon. That's not cool. Okay. I need to get this chest ASAP. <laughs> so we're going to do this the old fashioned way then. Destroy, destroy. Smoke, no smoke, smoke. Smoke, smoke. And I have enough for one shock. The opponent started to attack, whatever, he's probably gonna win. I'm just trying to get as many engine rooms down as I can. Smoke there. Shock. I don't know if I'm gonna get this one down, probably not. Depending that I have like two or three warriors left. Yeah. Oh, he has warriors as well. Well, he... 
you're probably going to clear me because I don't have that kind of base. So, he clearly has more of an advantage than I do. <laughs> it's just painful to watch. It's so painful to watch. Well, yep, good for you. Okay, halfway there. Okay, can we do this base? I don't know. Angry can, but there's so many mines in the way. So many mines. And why do they already have their doom cannon? But they have no stats. They have no stats. So, what we're going to do... What, we are, what are we going to do now? Hmm? Great. The Doom Cannon just ruins everything. We need to take care of that first. Hopefully the shock lasts long enough. Now go down here. Shock this stuff. Destroy that shock mine. Shock those machine guns. The boom cannons are a pain. Or the boom mines are a pain, actually. That's what I meant to say. Yep. I don't know if I can do this one though. Because there are so many mines. Just, okay. So many mines that I don't have enough energy. They didn't check that mine, really? I mean, I have to go through another battle if I don't get this one. Which I don't think I will. Too many cannons and defenses in the way. And I'm fiddle. Again. Opponent retreated. What did he do? Hammer! Hammer. 58%. I win. Thank you. Warriors. What did he do this time? He should have got me, right? Here's the same, he is in the same situation that I am in. Struggling for survival and transitioning to tanks. It's not a good story to tell right now. But one more engine room and we'll be okay. Don't worry. Do not worry. We'll get back into gold sooner or later. And then climb up to 17 and then 18. And then get back onto global leaderboard. Hopefully. Staying optimistic. Yeah. So. Another three yard. Okay. What we've got here. We just need one. So. Probably we're just going to warrior rush and then just retreat or see as many as we can get. Critters here. Get out of here, get out of here, get out of here and get two, please.
get two. <laughs> I am probably gonna lose this one, but I don't care. It's worth it anyway. And I'm definitely gonna collect this chest in iron because there's no way I'm gonna get with in gold without it. That's for sure. Unless I flare onto this one and they might be able to take it out, but I doubt it. If I smoke them, maybe. Yeah, um, that's no way. There is no way I'm taking that thing down. <laughs> All right, here he has thanks. And he's gone the slow way around, so that's good. So when we get tanks, we are going to jump back into gold. Well, we already have tanks, but when we, when we get jump, jump out energy, more of it, we're going to jump back into jump back into gold and where we should be because players will not take us down so quickly as I take down them. So that's the the last loss in today's video hopefully. Collect this chest because I cannot make it into the gold without it unfortunately but now we are not gonna get this. Nope we're not. I'm gonna get this node right here because we need it ASAP. Upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. And we have only 236,000 left. How much does it cost? 330,000. Okay. How much? Oh, this is cheaper. Why is this more expensive? Why is this more expensive? Why? Why? Okay. Stop complaining. Okay, now I just need to know what to do now. Okay, use tank. Upgrade shock mines, maybe? Maybe we could. Boom mines need to be upgraded as well, but. Mmm, tricky, 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 tricky. Yep. And now I have to think about what path I'm going to take up here. Am I going to take the bottom path or the top path? I think I'm going to take... The bottom path has more gunboat energy for the rocket choppers, so that would be great. The top path has scorchers and bombardiers, so you are going to clear the base regardless if we have this path. So, which one am I going to choose? I have not yet decided yet. I'm leaning towards the top path because bombardiers are probably going to be reliable throughout the whole season instead of rocket shoppers because you know the thing with rocket shoppers they might be good at first but if you have to go back and get bombardiers then they'll be screwed over yes so bombardiers for me then i think unless i'm completely wrong with my logical thinking but hopefully this video sums up what I've been through this past day and it will help you along your text read journey. If you like this video please subscribe and peace.